Another word for meditation, a very good word. This really gets into the heart of it now. This is nalu. Nalu is a word that means wave. And if you're here for a while, you may hear somebody talk about hei nalu, which means wave sliding. It's a Hawaiian word for surfing. Okay? Uh, but nalu is the wave. But it doesn't just mean the physical wave. It can mean any wave, and it can mean thought waves as well. In the roots of this word is na, which means peacefulness or calmness, and alu, which means to join together or togetherness. Uh, that's significant because this kind, it's, nalu is a, a more passive kind of meditation. It's a meditation where you, you have an intention in the background, but you let the meditation do the work. You're not trying to make something happen. Okay? Uh, and so uh, this is, brings it into the realm of most yoga and Zen style uh, meditations. Okay? Uh, you meditate on something and allow something to happen uh, as an effect of that focus. Okay? Okay. So this Nalu type of meditation is, is for passive focus. I mentioned that, to connect with, to join to something, to merge with something else. And that's why it's so much like those other kinds of meditations a lot of you are probably familiar with. Okay. Uh, in Huna, this Huna knowledge, which I'm teaching, it's one of two primary methods of meditation. In a Nalu meditation, um, there's no explicit purpose. Like I said, the intention is held in the background. All meditation has a purpose, but it's not necessarily explicit. And so that's what a Nalu meditation is like. Um, let's have a little experience of that. I mean, you're free to do this or not do this, uh, but if you want to do it, it won't take long. We're going to do a one minute meditation uh, and a Nalu type of meditation. Very simple, but I'll tell you later how to expand on it. All I want to ask you to do, if you want, close your eyes to reduce distractions and just be aware of your breathing. Don't try to breathe differently. Just be aware of it for one minute. Your breathing may change, and that's okay. But you don't have to do anything to try and change it. Just be aware. Okay, come on back. And if you want to, move your fingers and toes to get a little back here if you went out. Uh, do we have any comments or questions on that experience? Yeah. I realized how much tension I was holding to my jaw. Ah, you became aware of that, huh? Yeah. Yes, right. It's a good way to become aware of tension in your body and if you do it for longer than a minute to start releasing it too, okay? Anybody else have anything? How many people enjoyed the process? That's nice. Good. Thank you. And it's such a very simple process. And I'm going to show you some other ways in, in which you can build on that. 